<sighs> well, good morning, folks. There we go. How are y'all doing today? So, today we're going to be starting an adventure of a classic JRPG, Final Fantasy VI, which, is, which was released as Final Fantasy III in the United States back in 1994. And I believe, yeah, it should be the original version of it, the original SNES version. So, let's get to it, I suppose. And hopefully, I, I'm using a new camera. Hopefully, it doesn't freeze. Today is my first real test after patching all the things I need. We'll see. Starts very differently from other Final Fantasies until this point. Well, way more sinister. I'm getting moving my windows around, so if the sound goes quiet. That's me changing windows. All right, so let's do this. Long ago, the War of the Magi reduced the world to a scorched wasteland, and magic simply ceased to exist. A thousand years have passed. Iron, gunpowder, and steam engines have been rediscovered, and high technology reigns. Hey, Ice. Perfect timing. Game just started. But there are some who would enslave the world by reviving the dread, destructive force known as magic. Hey, Michael. Welcome. Can it be that those in power are on the verge of repeating a senseless and deadly mistake? Could it be? Ah, <sighs> there's the town. Hard to believe an esper has been found intact there. A thousand years after the War of the Magi. Think it's still alive? Probably, judging from the urgency of our orders. And this woman, this sorcerer, why is she here? I heard she fried 50 of our Magitek armored soldiers in under three minutes. Not to worry, the slave crown on her head robs her of all conscious thought. She'll follow orders. We'll approach from the east. Move out. No, I'm pretty sure in the uh, this is I'm I'm playing like the original SNES American release version, so there is a lot of dialogue and some names that have, were changed when they re-released it for uh, for Game Boy Advanced, and I'm pretty sure Vix was changed to Biggs, Biggs and Wedge were a consistent kind of duo in Final Fantasy. Uh, they have him they have him named Vix in this. Uh, original version. But yeah, I remember playing the 
I, I played the original back when it back when I was in like middle school, and then I played the Game Boy Advance version, and I noticed all over the place. It's like, wow, like this line is way different, and I feel like it was better in the original. Like they cleaned it up, they made it more family friendly, I guess, in the director's cut version of it. It was released years and years later. So I wanted to revisit the original one. Also, for those who have been watching me for a while, you'll notice that like my green screen line is pretty much gone. The new camera I got is really good at uh, at, at that. At chroma keying and I have twice the frame right now so that's nice went from a 30 FPS camera to a 60 1080p the lighting might look a little different I think the lighting is more natural now at least like the, the lamps I use are just you know just basic tall floor lamps you can get uh, at like any any supermarket or hardware store or anything, they're not uh, they're not white light. They're the kind of they're the kind of soft indoor lighting. Uh, so I think I think the coloring is a little more natural. Uh, but I am hoping they add some more RGB adjustment options options for the camera down the line. We'll see. All right, let's put her on point. No sense in taking any risk forward. Oh, no, no sense in taking any risks. Forward! Alright, so now I get to control. Imperial Magitech armor. Not even Narsh is safe anymore. Alright. So they're just throwing me right into the fray. Being forced to fight for the imp Empire. Like, these poor people don't stand a chance. Vix gained a level. Wedge gained a level. <laughs> yep, this one is six or three. Depending on which country it was released in. Nauseous freedom depends on us! Lobo. So remember, magic's not a thing that has been seen in the world for the last several hundred or thousand years, something like that. But our character here, question mark character, is able to use it. Interesting. All the other abilities we have are, you know, tech-based. I also have the option to uh, fast forward if I need to. <laughs> the Esper's got to be here. Move out. So, if there get to be any parts in the game that just feel like they're dragging, I can fast forward. <laughs> We got him trapped now. Oh, I'm just fine. Thank you. How are you? Honestly, it doesn't really matter which attack I choose for these guys. It's I'm pretty sure this scene is just to show how outmatched this this town is compared to the Empire. Mm -hmm. 
It's a very dark old opening. We must defend the mines! Yeah, I love the atmosphere that the- just even the opening title screen has for this game up until this point you know Final Fantasy 1 through 5 have always been like very like grand and adventurous and like look to the sky it's a brand new day kind of kind of opening this one's dark and thundery and sinister definitely this one definitely was a uh, you know attempt to breathe new life into the series, you know, give it a different kind of, uh, tone. According to our source, the Frozen Esper was found in a new mine shaft. Maybe this one. It was also made around the time of, um, I think it was made, like, in conjunction with Chrono Trigger. Like, made around the same time, and, yeah. Good stuff. This is 94, I forget when Chrono Trigger was, exactly. Do your thing. And I think this, I, I, I forget, was this the first game to introduce the active time battle system? Our little gauges right there are showing us when we get to attack, and the enemies have their own invisible ones. Uh, instead of it just being, you know, turn-based, you can, yeah, the ATB system was introduced. Because I know they use it in 7 as well, and 8, and probably 9. Yes, I want to save. It's save points. You can use a sleeping bag or tent and also save for save a game. If you should perish, you'll automatically be able to play from the last save. Though any GP, treasures, etc. you found will have to be found again, your level and EXP data will be retained. You can save a game anywhere on the world map. That's nice. Alright. Do I have any of those? No, I don't. Oh, I guess I could cure them. Yeah, Chrono Trigger was 95, so just a year later. So, like, yeah. We're probably being work on, worked on at the same time. This is uh, okay. So Layla, so this was released as Final Fantasy III in the United States back in the '90s, uh, but it is actually Final Fantasy VI. It was re-released for the GBA years later as Final Fantasy VI. But the order of release for the American Final Fantasies was one was one. The American two was the Japanese four. And the American 3 was the Japanese 6. And then they started going 7, 8, 9, 10. Uh, yeah, so we got 1, 4, and 6. Uh, but then later on, we would get them all. Yeah, they, they didn't send over 2, uh, 3, and 5 to us until many years later. I'll handle this. Stand back. Uh, where's my button? There it is. We won't hand over the Esper. 
Wilk, get him! It's a slug. Hold it! Think back to our briefing. What about it? Do you recall hearing about a monster that eats lightning? And stores the energy in its shell. Right, so whatever you do, don't attack the shell. All right, all right, all right already. All right already. All right, so no attacking the shell, just the... Just the slug. Just the snail. I don't know what expert is, is but I'll try tech missile. So yeah, up until this point, they, uh, the series had definitely been a lot more, um, like, high fantasy focused. Like, D&D, &D, castles, knights, and stuff. But also with a good smattering of, like, uh, future technology here and there. Uh, but, yeah, 6 is the first one to... F it, it does a lot more of a kind of modern modern slash futuristic feel to it um like heavily tech based uh the you know that is a big part of the um like magic being missing from the world is a big part of the story as we as we just saw in the opening however our mysterious green haired person here is able to use magic one of the possibly only the only person able to right now and the Empire seems to be trying to unlock the se secrets of magic to be able to you know conquer the world hello bestie <laughs> so y'all uh you know, be sure to let me know, like, how my... Like, I can't watch it the whole time. I got a new camera set up, and, uh... If it, if it happens to freeze at any time, please let me know. Uh, it's, it's higher quality. Uh, but it... I had to... I had to get some... Updates for my motherboard and ship sets to make it actually work. Oh, okay. x is an instant kill. Right on. It's like Doom. Cool. Yeah. Meh, meh. What am I doing? Where's my button? Oh, yeah, I'm hitting the wrong button. Here we go. Yeah, this game's always a treat to come back to. <sighs> this is the Frozen Esper. Hey, what's the matter? Do you know something we don't? frozen creature began emitting an eerie light. Oh good, yeah. Yep. Yeah, you'll notice that the, uh, my usual green screen outline is pretty much gone. Like, and I'm also, my FPS is doubled, so I went from 30 to 60. A lot clearer picture now, and the lighting should be a lot more natural to what it's actually like in my room, for the most part. All right. Where's that light coming from? Ugh! Hey! Wedge, where are you? What? What's happening? Hmm. 
I'm not sure what game you're talking about, Bestie. Where am I? Whoa! And I only just removed the crown. Head hurts. Easy. This is a slave crown. The others had complete control over you while you were wearing it. I can't remember a thing. Don't worry. It'll all come back to you. In time, that is. Uh, you know what? I played a little bit of uh, Final Fantasy XIV, the online one, uh, for the last two streams. But, yeah, I wanted something that was a more familiar narrative for me to stream. I might still play that on my own. But, um, yeah, I, I was, I ca I'm kind of in the mood for Final Fantasy. And I wanted to treat y'all to one of my favorites in the series. Six. Yeah. A mysterious young woman controlled by the Empire and born with a gift of magic. Her name is Terra. My name is Terra. Impressive. I've never heard of anyone recovering this fast. Open up! Get back the girl in the Empire's Magitech armor! Open this door! We want that girl! She's an officer of the Empire! Empire? Magitech armor? Look, you, I have to get you out of here. I don't have time to explain. Over here! No. Not yet. Got to check clocks. <laughs> you'll get you'll get stuff. Clocks have elixirs. Open this door. We want that girl. She's an officer of the empire. Make your way out through the mines. I'll keep these brutes occupied. Oops, <laughs> I hit the fast forward button. She's up there! Oh, go. At some point I get the ability to run faster as well, uh, but I might have to get special boots. But they come pretty quickly in the game, so I won't always be at this speed. All right, nothing there. Yep, all clocks have elixirs in them for some reason. <laughs> Preemptive attack. All right, well, I hope you have a good night. Have a good one, bestie. Oh, no. Oh, yeah. ATB, I gotta actually fight. So you don't just take turns with this system. Uh, like, you'll see my gauge that shows when I can attack next. The enemies also have their own. And if I, if I just stop playing, they will keep attacking me. The game doesn't just wait on you. Like the uh, previous entries though I forget if this one this game was the one that introduced that or not Phoenix down <laughs> yep this was uh this being so so early in the release of Final Fantasies to America, some of the names and some of the spelling is different than how it would become to be standardized. They spell Phoenix down with an F in this one. Though, of course, they changed that when they re-released the game for the GBA. You think 4 started it? That sounds right. 
At least in America, yeah. The ATB system. Maybe it was too in Japan. Yeah, I forgot. So it wasn't necessarily the, uh, it's interesting because that complaint, early complaints a lot of people had about these styles of games were like, oh, you gotta wait your turn. It's like you're being polite to the enemy, letting each other, letting you hit each other. Uh, not necessarily with the ATB system. It's, it's a little bit closer to, uh, an, uh, you know, uh, an action RPG because, yeah, you're not exactly waiting for your turn. It's, yeah, still a little bit of that, but, yeah, this was, like, a step closer to it being a little more realistic. Sleeping bag. I gotta heal myself. I can't say I'm a, a complete expert at this game or anything, but now I've got a friend who knows like all the best party combinations and moves and whatnot. I'm not there, but I have played it a, a lot, lot, lot. Repo man, Why are you in here? Ah! Yeah, they spelled it uh, as P H O E N I X in uh, in nine. Uh, they, I think, right after this one, they did like seven had the correct spelling for Phoenix Down. Got her. Hey, man. Just a moment. I'm going to move my video feed over here just to make it easier for me to read and stuff. There we go. <clears> hmm. <throat> Great. My sweet little magic user. <laughs> With this slave crown, I'll practically own you. Kefka. One of Final Fantasy's best villains. <laughs> Good. Burn up everything. We stand on the brink of a major breakthrough. In the days to come, we'll witness a total revival of magic. Huh. It is our destiny, and ours alone, to take this mystic force and claim what is rightfully ours. With our newfound power, nothing can stand in our way. Hurrah! Love! Long live Emperor Gestal!
took you long enough. How goes the robbing and plundering trade? <laughs> Treasure hunter and, and trail-worn traveler, searching the world over for relics of the past. Lock. I prefer the term treasure hunting. Ha, huh. semantic nonsense. Oh, there's a huge difference! Anyway, were you the one who sent, sent for me? Yeah, there's a girl I'd like you to meet. D this better not have anything to do with that Magitek riding Imperial witch! Imperial troops are pursuing her even as we speak. This town is no match for the Empire. Our independence can only be assured if we join forces with the Returners, an underground resistance movement. That girl wasn't responsible for her actions. We must get her to... to understand our dilemma. Ah, <sighs> alright. I think we'd better help her. Agreed. Make your way first to Figaro, and talk to the King. Is this where the term Magitech came from? It might have been the first instance on in uh, Final Fantasy. Yeah. Now we got you. Wonderful. There's a whole bunch of them. Kubo. Yay, the Moogles. Good King Mogglemog. Moogles. Are you saying you want to help me? Kubo! Use us to save Terra from the guards. Need more information? You know what? I'm good. I know what I'm doing. We're doing a uh, triple threat thing. Essentially... Yep, get to block the path to protect Terra. <laughs> Where do you think you're going? Not here. Kushu, Kurin, Kuru, and Kamag. Ooh, that hurt. Ooh, they're hard hitters. All right. Kupik, Kupop, Kumama. I know Kupos or Kupos. Uh, Moogles are the best. Good King Mogglemog, good King Mog, kind of noble lord. is knowing how to use your resources because I don't know if anyone here can heal so I don't want to be doing all the battles with just one little party you're next Mog Cuckoo, Kutan and Kupan there's our buddy good old Mog Learned a new dance. Well, let's, let's use a dance. Dusk Requiem. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> 
I love how they all have different weapons. That's wonderful. It feels like this this little part of the tor tutorial is also there to show what kind of weapons there can be down the line. Maybe something like that. Not, I'm not sure. <laughs> it's just showing, just highlighting Moogles for the fun of it. Ah, it burns! Oh no! Ooh, mama! You're gonna have to go get some rest after this fight. All right, she's safe. Here you go, Kumama. Not that I needed to do that, but it made me feel good. I think we're good. I don't think they're... Oh, hey, hello. You're there. Oh no! <laughs> yes. Oh, good. No! Not cuckoo. Avenge Cuckoo. Ah, they'll recover. They'll be fine. They just need a nappy. Thanks, Moogles. We're in your debt. I think this switch will... Yeah, you back with us now? You saved me? Save your thanks for the Moogles. Uh, I, I, I can't remember anything, past or present. You have amnesia? A man said my memory would come back. Ah, give it time. You're safe with me. I give you my word. I won't leave you until your memory returns. By the way, this secret entrance might be useful someday. Don't forget about it. This is a classroom for the beginner. Here we answer your questions about the world. Think of us as your advisors. Tutorial house. That's all it is. Yay. I'm healed. Now, is there a save point? Not that I need it. I don't think I need a save point right now. I can just leave. There we go. Now we're on. Now we can save anywhere on the world map. Doodle -dee -doo -doo -doo. And so we're headed to Figaro. Leafer. Couldn't steal. So Locke has the ability to steal things. Bop, bop, 
Figaro Castle. Wait! Uh, hey, oh, it's you. Proceed. You mean this young woman? Who, who do you think you are? Oh, sorry. How rude of me to turn my back, back to a lady. The young king of Figaro Castle, ally to the Empire and a master designer of machinery. Edgar. I am Edgar, King of Figaro. Surprise someone like me knows a king? <laughs> Talk to you later. So, you're an Imperial soldier. No problem. Figaro and the Empire are allies. Please, relax while you're here. It's not in my blood to harm a lady. Look, why are you helping me? Is it because of my... abilities? I'll give you three reasons. First of all, your beauty has captivated me. Secondly, I'm dying to know if I'm your type. I guess your abilities would be a distant third. What's with you, anyway? <sighs> guess my technique's getting a bit rusty. Hmm, I suppose a normal girl would have found him dashing, but I'm hardly normal. Yay. Replaced our phoenix down, we lost. It pays to do a little exploring in these places. Nice. Tonic. Antidote. Oh, all right. I'm going to take both of these. He's only, he doesn't actually talk. Just sells things. Huh. So I guess tonics and tinctures are our potions for this game. Another thing that will later get standardized. Received a soft. Just in case we get stoned. Mm, nothing really in here that I need to see. Okay. Well, just let me leave. All right. Wait! Ah, oh, it's you. Proceed. Where do I need to go? Need rest? Sure. Rest sounds nice. Mm -hmm. Oh, that'll 
will just take me outside. All right. Guess I gotta go find either Locke or Edgar again. Is he gonna say what every time? Is who gonna say what? Maybe you have to go back here? Nah, those aren't actually entrances. Okay. Alright. So, nothing there. Where to, then? I heard the Empire's using something called magic. Gestals harness the power of magic. Who can stop him now? Hmm, maybe I can go down these stairs? No, those aren't stairs. Oh, it's you. Proceed, probably. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Doesn't look like it, but this castle incorporates some of the most high-tech devices in existence. For example... Oops, they're, uh, they're all top secret. Okay, so there are these areas. Prison cells. Hey. Who are you? I'm Lone Wolf, the pickpocket. Relax, they're just blowing off steam. But I'm telling you, there's no sense keeping us here. We're just all small potatoes compared to the real threat lurking about here, and King Edgar knows it. Hey, a clock. Is there an elixir in there? No, there's not. I think it's got to be a grandfather clock. Okay. Okay, here we go. Beyond this... Uh, beyond is the Figaro Castle engine room. We're ready to leave at a moment's notice. That's dangerous. But I want to go. Fine. I guess I'm not allowed. Maybe I'll just keep... Oh. Maybe I'll just keep talking to the prisoners and someone will say something. Yeah. I forget. I demand to see Edgar. How dare they keep us in this stinking pit? These thieves have been terrorizing the vicinity. Stay away from them. Hey, let us out of here! Okay. I've pretty much seen all the castle has to offer, I think. Is there anything left I need to do? No, I don't think I should leave. Alright. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Proceed. I think I just gotta talk to someone specific. Bum, bum, bum. Figaro Castle is the most modern structure in the world. about you guys? Scholars the world over are doing research on magic. Silly people, scholars. Long ago, a force called magic existed. People who used magic were called mage knights. Okay. This is Figaro, the desert castle. Tch, all right. Well, there's a spot. Okay. Weapons and items manufactured here are sent to South Figaro. All right, let's go see what's in the other tower.
Edgar has a twin brother. He was such a nice boy. Brother, what's wrong with father? What's all this talk about his successor? Are you blind? Look how thin his face has become. What is it? Brother! Tears? Edgar's twin brother who traded the throne for his own freedom. Seven. Yes, his name is Sabin. Oh, he looks so like his father. When he ran away, he was a sweet little child. I wonder what he's like now. All right, cool. His Highness said he'd marry me when I get older. The Empire smashed the three cities on the southern continent. Just a matter of time till they come up here. Back to the throne room. <laughs> Who are you? The old business of the succession was so repugnant to Sabin, the king's brother, that he fled the castle forever. The succession was settled with a coin toss. There he is. Well, how do you like my castle? King Edgar, someone from the Empire is to see you. Probably Kefka. Fooey! Emperor Gestal's stupid orders. Edgar, you pinhead. Why do you have to live in the middle of nowhere? These recon jobs are the pits. Ahem. There's sand on my boots. Y yes, sir. All set, sir. Idiots! Uh, sir Kevka, what on earth do- Out of my way! Okay, I'm controlling Edgar now. Talk. Talk to a Kefka. You've been busy down south, looking for more cities to destroy? That's... Oh, that's, <laughs> that was Edgar. You've been busy down south, looking for more cities to destroy? That's for us to know. No, I thought we were allies. What are you doing in my domain? Nothing. What brings Kefka, humble servant of the em of Emperor Gestal, into our lowly presence? A girl of no importance recently escaped from us. We heard she found refuge here. Hmm. This wouldn't have anything to do with this witch everyone's been whispering about, would it? Uh, just a moment. I've got a message I gotta get to real quick. Uh, come on. Just a moment. Ba -ba -da -ba -da -ba. All right. Lies! She merely stole something of minor value. Is she here? Hmm, that's a tough one. Let me get this back over here. There we go. 
You see, there are more girls here than grains of sand out there. I can't keep tra track of them all. I'd hate to be you if we find out you're lying. Mwaha! I truly hope nothing happens to your precious Figaro. I'd say that guy's missing a few buttons. Where's Terra? Take her to her room. I'd love to chat with you, but the Chancellor and I must plan our strategy. Sometimes I hate being a king, if you'll excuse me. Follow me. Don't you worry about a thing. I'll... You're Locke, right? Edgar told me about you. Is it true you're a thief? That's Treasure Hunter! On the surface, Edgar pretends to support the Empire. The truth is, he's collaborating with the Returners, an, organiza an organization opposed to the Empire. I'm his contact with that group. The old man you met in Narsh is one of us. Empire. But I'm a soldier of the Empire. That's not true. They were using you. Things are different now. I don't understand. What should I do? I can't tell you what to do. You don't have to decide right now. You'll soon find your way. But how will I know which way is right? You'll soon find your way. Hmm? What the? What's happening? It's the Empire! It's Kepka! What are you doing? Bring me the girl, now! I don't know what you're talking about. Then, welcome to my barbecue! <laughs> fire! 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 <laughs> if they both say the same thing. Alright. Let us get out of here. Oh, can't go that way. Get ready. Yes, sir. Changed your mind? I guess I have no choice. Or maybe I do. Ah, shameful that a king should flee, leaving his people behind. How utterly delightful. Jump! Okay, dive now! Yahoo! <laughs> what is this? Hmm. <laughs> They're running sprites, I'm losing it. Yeah. <laughs> No one can touch the people of Figaro. Yeah, the sprites are very, uh, very well animated. Especially, you know, for the time period. Very good work. Go! Get them!
tools. Auto crossbow. Bow. Edgar's tools are pretty good. Yeah. Edgar, what's the matter? You look positively spooked. D did you just see what I, s I just saw? Yeah, this this kid seems loaded for bear. Loaded for bear. She's amazing. That was magic. M A G I C. B -b magic? She used magic. <laughs> Whisper, whisper, whisper. Uh, Tara, where on earth did you learn that? Sorry, I... Um... Look, I, I didn't make me to make such a big deal of this. Uh, me neither. It's just that I've never actually seen magic before. Where did you... Edgar, Tara... Edgar, Tara can use magic and we can't. That's the only difference between us. The fact is, we could use her help. Thank you, Locke. Thank you, Edgar. <laughs> Stop swooning. <laughs> Uh-oh. Oh, no. I need cure. Nice. Yeah, the enemies just stand there and let you have that conversation. Okay, so potions are a thing. What are tonics then? Bravo, Figaro! Son of a submariner! They're pay for they'll pay for this! This is great! Was that a bad person? I... I'm scared. Tara, there's someone I'd like you to meet. We're members of the Returners. Our mentor, Bannon, would certainly like to meet you. Magic's gonna be the key to winning this war. Magic? Tara has magical powers. That Esper seemed to react to her. Can there be some connection? I haven't the foggiest. It just seems natural to me that I have the use of this power. But no human is born with the powers you seem to have, and... I... I apologize. What should I do? I'm sure the Empire is going to come after you. If they get their hands on you again, the world's finished. Terra, you want to understand your, your own powers, right? Then I think we need to consult with Bannon. Please. Okay, to the south there's a cave that leads to South Figaro. Chocobos. Uh, I guess we're going this way, maybe. No, not quite. It must be one of these dots. But where? No, that's not a cave. Hmm. Like I could try this spot. I don't think it's it, though. No, Chocobo! Oh, there it is. <laughs> King Edgar, where are you headed? Through the cave, and eastward to South Figaro. Return to the castle, and tell the others we're safe. Yes, sir! Take care! A turtle. Recovery spring. Do -do -do -do. 
forwarding through some of these battles make it quicker let's try to steal nice Sure. I guess I should look at what those do exactly. Tonic recovers 50 HP. Potion is 250. Huh. Alright. Do I need it? Terror I do. There's more stuff here. Yeah. Phoenix down. Made it through. South Figaro. Oh, hello. The cafe, huh? At the very least, you could give me a response. Stand back. He seems vaguely familiar. Wait a minute. He owes allegiance to no one, and he'll do anything for money. He comes and goes like the wind. Shadow. Uh, that's Shadow! He'd slit his mama's throat for a nickel. <laughs> this is one of the lines they replaced. In the, uh, in the, in the like re-release of it, for one, I think it may be it may have been too gruesome for them to keep. For another, there are no nickels in this world. Gill is the currency. <laughs> currency. So I, that's what I assume anyway. Slit his mama's throat for a nickel. Yeah, one of the uh, one of the one of the lines they PGified. They they made more kid friendly on the director's cut release. 
Ugh, better, better steer clear of him, I guess. Hello, Shadow. Hello, Shadow. Leave us. The dog eats strangers. The dog's name is Interceptor. And yeah, this is Shadow's theme music. shadow. Uh, hey, there's a guy in there. Hello. The Empire attacked Figaro Castle? Oh, now we'll all be drawn into the battle. Oh, hi, Shadow. Oh, hi, Mark. Alright. Looks like they're selling stuff. Sprint shoes, that's what we want. <laughs> One of the most important items in the game. It doesn't say what they do, that's annoying. What's what's creepy? All right, what do we want? Equip body, or is it an accessory relic? Relic, I think. Yeah, sprint shoes. Now we walk a lot faster. Ain't that nice. He's a ninja. He's gotta be subversive. He subverts. I think I'm looking for... I think I'm looking for the word covert, actually. <laughs> He's gotta be covert. Yeah. Yeah, now I get to walk at twice the speed. This should be standard. This shouldn't be an item. Yeah, I actually have no idea what, uh, what all these accessories do. I think in the re-release they actually said what they did when you hovered over them, but you have to buy them to find out in this one. That's annoying. Now, is there a weapon shop? He'll, he'll slit his mama's throat for a nickel. <laughs> what a line. Uh, no elixir in this clock. Alright, so this is all just um, potions and whatnot, all usables. So that's what the lamp stands for. Uh, there's an armor shop. And a sword and a weapon shop. Good. Arsenal. Well, we got both of these. Regalia Cutlass. Regal Cutlass. We'll get two of those. And a mithril dagger knife for lock. There we go. <laughs> oh, they crawling into someone else's bed and watching them sleep. <laughs> yeah, that's what you—that's what you're saying—is creepy. Yeah, that makes more sense. I wouldn't—I wouldn't necessarily say shadows creepy, just dangerous. Heavy shield. Hmm. Plum tan. You know what? I—I I forget. Can I? Can I equip two weapons in my hands? Uh, maybe.
Hmm, maybe not. Darn. There's gotta be a shield. Hairband. Heavy shield. Well, I could. Kung Fu suit. Like, I think I'm doing okay. I, I kind of want to get some of those accessories. me. Oh, there we go. Good, you gotta click on it. Protects against dark and petrify. Protects party members who are low on HP. That can be super useful. Star pendant protects against poison. Goggles protects against dark. Low on HP. I don't really have a, a tank character right now. Certainly could make one. You know what, Edgar, you can be a true knight today. Since you are a king, you get to be a knight. So you will take damage in place of people who are about to get hurt. And because we're making him the knight, we're going to equip him with the best armor. Or as much as I can get away with anyway. So... Plumed hat for Edgar, and a heavy shield for Edgar, and another heavy shield for Terra. There we go. I think we're all suited up. Since she's got to be our healer, also want her defended really well. Nice. I think we're ready to continue. Ah, you need to equip a specific relic to equip two weapons. Gotcha. Gotcha. I forget if that... Yeah, I forget if they made that a necessity in the, in the uh, re-release or not. Or if you could just do it automatically. But I... Yeah, I forget. Cool. I think we're pretty well equipped to do whatever we need to do now. Let's see. Where to go? Where to go? didn't really specify, but they did. I guess we can go talk to the bartender at the cafe, or the barista. You know it's a bar. We all know it's a bar, but they had to <laughs> they had to change it to cafe for the American release. We know what this is. Uh, it's nice to be walking at a reasonable speed now. Alright, you. Hey. Hey. Talk to me. I guess he won't. Fine. What about you? Duncan made his son, Vargas, practice a strict martial arts lifestyle. Vargas resented it. Duncan. Who are you? Out of the way. I gotta get this cider over to the old man. That's my job. Now scram. A cider, huh? Does that mean I can come in and take it? Give me that cider. Never, never mind. Guess not. Hey. Duncan students have no peers. The guy at the counter? Ooh, he's kind of creepy. Well, there you go. Someone else called him creepy. <laughs> The Empire has been invading one town after the next. We're not safe here. Okay. All right, game. Where do you want me to go? Mm -hmm. Equip relics to gain a variety of abilities. These double walking sp my walking speed. Yeah! 
<laughs> that they do. Oh, hello, Mog. Relics give your party members a variety of abilities. For example, sprints use double your speed. True Knight lets you shield others during battle. Dra Dragoon Boots add, add the jump command to your battle list. Gauntlet allows you to hold a sword with both hands. Use the main menu to equip two relics per person. <laughs> I didn't call nin call Shadow Creepy. Ninja's gonna ninja. <laughs> ah, funny. Oh, you didn't. Someone else did, though. Chocobos! Okay. So let's go explore some houses, I suppose. Uh, maybe this house. It's a big one. His war really begun? I'd better return home. Okay. Hello. <laughs> yep. Did you hear? Figaro Castle sank into the sand. You couldn't find it even if you knew where to look. There's a couple more houses. Mr. Colts is to the Mount Mister. Mount Colts is to the east. Well, maybe that's where I need to go next. Oh, this guy with the cider, I think. I think this is the same guy. I'm off work. Get lost. I don't like strangers. Bring me some cider and maybe I'll talk to you. Cider, eh? Hmm. It's you again. Maybe I'll beat you to the cafe and get the cider. Yeah, I'm not sure how this this one works. Give me cider. No, 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 there he is. Oh, okay, he does the cider thing again. I can't just take it. I guess I gotta find some elsewhere. Oh well. Don't know if it's a requirement right now. I'll probably do other things. Mr. Colts. Good old Mr. Colts. Could be that I come back at a different time when Shadow's not standing there, you know? and I can buy some cider from the bartender. I could also check, go away, the potion shop and see if uh, they sell it. Nah, it's like a key item. This town will go down fighting. Even with their Magitech armor, we'll ha we'll make it tough on them. My husband Duncan is a world famous martial artist. He's taking his he's taking his disciples to Mount Colts for meditation and training. Okay, so sounds like we should head to Mount Colts. Sure, save point. <laughs> right, it's a totally cider, not alcoholic. Alcohol's a myth. A placebo. Yeah. Yeah, no alcohol in this world. People just go into the cider bar to get some cider. 
they're excited for cider. Alright, I could take a chocobo, but yeah, I'm, I'm just gonna walk. Mount Colts. To the east. Lock gained a level. You know what I didn't do though? I didn't rest at the inn. I probably should. Either staying at the inn or getting a sleeping bag. How much money do I have left? Oh, I got plenty. I can get a couple sleeping bags then. I think it's. I guess it'd be good to check what the cost of the inn versus the sleeping bag is. But I'll just I'll just sleep at the inn first. Probably changes depending on where you are. Eighty gil. Ah, that's cheap. Yeah. <laughs> A nickel. Nickels don't exist. Yeah, definitely during the time where I think uh, Nintendo of America's translation team had a little bit more freedom to write what they wanted. I, I feel like I saw see this see some remnants of that, and uh, maybe it might have been even the same translation team for uh, like Super Mario RPG, like the line where they're in the they're in the forest and they're about to save Gino. And Mario just starts throwing punches at the air. And uh, Malo's like, oh, who, who do you think you are, Bruce Lee? Like, not a reference I think would be, would pass anymore. It's like, oh, well, we got to keep it, we got to keep it to the Mushroom Kingdom. Can't, we can't be mentioning real people. That kind of writing, it, it seems, I, I'm wondering how many people worked on this and also worked on, on that. All right, tents are pretty expensive, uh, unfortunately. Sleeping bags, ah, oh, well, can't afford either of them. I can sell some stuff, though. Don't need that. Or that. Or that. Or this. There we go. Cover HP and MP to 100%. I think it only works for one person, though. Hmm. Anything else I can sell? Not really. Not a sleeping bag. <laughs> there. That'll do it. Now I can buy a tent. And that should... That yeah, recovers all the party's HP and MP. There we go. Now we're... Now we're seriously ready. Don't want to leave town without preparing. It'll be less relevant to do so later once we just have a whole bunch of sleeping bags or tents. Oh, hello. Little house. Get him, Edgar! A little house. Hmm. What's that smell? What's that smell? And this... And this, his favorite tea, received a tonic. Hmm. And this, his favorite tea. These dishes, they were his favorite. Interesting. Seven. He was here? <laughs> yeah, Bruce Lee canonically exists in the Mario universe. <laughs> What the? 
you, you know this guy? Of course. He left a couple days ago after, after he heard Master Duncan was slain. He headed into the mountains. I heard Duncan's son, Vargas, is missing as well. I have a bad feeling about this. I guess Edgar pulled out a photo or something. You know this guy. Okay. Alright, to the east then. So it looks like... Seven was staying there. Mount Cult. Mr. Cults. Oh no! Oh my god, why? Why do you hit so hard? Jeez. I'm gonna have to run back to town or something. Jeez. I was not prepared. Okay. Oh yeah, right. I think I gotta get them all better armor. Didn't realize how underpowered I was. Get out of my way. Oh yeah, you can also flee if, I, if you need to. If you can pull it off. Oh my. I'm in trouble. Time to run away. Oh no! Let me go. Oh boy. There we go. <laughs> Oof. Was not expecting that. Fast forward. <laughs> I think that revives Terra, yeah. Terra strong. Okay, how much money do we have? Eh, we have enough for maybe another... Oops. Piece of armor, too. It wouldn't hurt to load us all up. Bands, plum, plum tat, cotton robe. Tara, you could use both of these. I'm not really sure what the hairband is for. I'm curious. So it's 12 defense. This one's 14. Why would I want the hairband? Alright. Lock, you could also use a heavy shield. much better for her. Alright, have a good one, Phoenix. Whew. I also feel like they might have made the need to grind a little less necessary in the uh, in the director's cut as this one I think can get grindy at some points thankfully I have a fast forward button <laughs> if I ever need to for example yay Terra gained a level let's 
So we'll try this again. Okay. Ow. Could not steal. You gotta steal better. Huh. Hey, a shadowy man. Okay. Go steal. Owie! Good. Mod gained a level. Yeah, yeah, tent. I need to sort. There we go. Da, 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 hello. Yay. That's nice. Tent. Everyone's fully healed.
great. Oh my god. <laughs> well, that didn't work out well. <laughs> Alright, so she's poisoned. I gotta give her an antidote. Seven since you write. Who are you? Seven? Is he here? You were shadowing us earlier, right? Brilliant. And... And how unlucky it is that you have run into me. Oh no. He has bears. Come on, what's the matter? anything else to steal. Enough! Off with you now! Give it up, Vargas! Is that you, Seven? 
Vargas, why'd you do it? How could you do... How could you do your own father in like that? Fool. He made the mistake of choosing you as his successor. He snubbed me. His only son. No. You were the one he chose. You're a liar. Our master wanted you to be a successor, not me. He appreciated your fine spirit. Enough of your lies. Now, have a taste of my superior technique. Oh, snap. It's going Dragon Ball Z on us. Ah, oh, seven. The master taught you well. I guess there's no avoiding this. Fate ma made us train together, and fate will send you to your doom. Okay, what's the input? It doesn't tell me. Okay. Am I supposed to know this? Okay, hold on. Give me a sec. I guess I'm so... <laughs> Maybe there's a guidebook that comes with this. Like, yeah, they definitely improved on some things with the re-release, so I'll have to look it up. Yeah, it's left, right, left. Unfortunately, it just doesn't show you. God dang it. Oh, come on. Ugh. God dang it. Go on, eat it. Ugh, okay. I don't, I'm not positive when I'm supposed to do this. Oh my god. I'm gonna die. Yeah, we're gonna lose this. That sucks. Yeah, this, I think this is the end. Yep, I'm done. I lose. I lose Final Fantasy. Goodbye, the end of the game. Oh, that's super annoying. Gosh. Just a moment. Well, I get these back, I guess. That's something. Yeah, I forget when I'm supposed to do the input. I've tried I tried several spots. Bah. I'll also after I'm done after I'm done today, I'll consider I'll I'll probably end up looking up um the changes they made in the GBA version. If it's if it's generally an easier playthrough, I, I might end up starting that one and getting playing up to this point for tomorrow. Or like like playing up to this point before tomorrow's stream so that just that we're in the same place. If it's if it's a more convenient playthrough at this point, if it fixes a lot of issues then Yeah. Sadly, the writing's not going to be the same, but... Oh, well. I think I can... I think that's fine. It's not like they ruin anything. Thought I was serious about what? I have no idea what you're talking about.
do not know. Blah, 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 blah. Blah, blah, blah. Ending the game? Oh, no, no not like the end. But, yeah. Like, if I die, it just puts me back to the, uh... Save point. It's annoying. Come on. Dang it, we're all poisoned. Not good. And two of us are. That would have been a great ending. Yeah, now I'm curious to see um, which what what kind of changes they made in the re-release. If they if they balance the uh, the leveling and whatnot better or what? Because I, I remember playing through it and not really feeling like I struggled much, especially not in this early section. This isn't too much of a struggle, honestly, but. It does feel like it's a little bit tougher. Ugh. I'm fine with toughness, just not just as long as I'm not not requiring the player to grind a whole lot, you know. Hello, Vargas. Huh. Okay. Ah, oh, crap. Oh, poo. Come on. Oh, that hurts. A lot. Kill the poo! Hmm. Yeah, good block. Shabin to the rescue. Alright. You know what? I'm gonna advantage myself. Just, let's see. There we go. Save state. Dun, 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 dun. I gotta learn how to, when I'm supposed to do these. Blah, 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 blah. Blah, 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 blah. Blah, 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 blah. Blitz. Blah, blah. Nope. Not that one. No. Dang it. Overshot. Ugh, I'm doing it when the light, when he's light up, lit up like that. Is that not right? Ah, uh, <laughs> I don't know. Hmm. 
Nope. Fine. Loading the save. I'm not gonna let a bad button presses in zero direction mess with me on that part. Right, left. It's not. It's not doing anything. Nope. I pretty much tried it at every point. Oh, you know what? I think I probably have to... Oh, let's see. Maybe before you select it? There he goes. Okay, now I got it. So the order is you select Blitz, and then you do your code, and then you confirm. Okay. What, what the? He? Okay. Already taught you that? If only you hadn't been in such a rush for power. Uh, just one hit. Nice. Now I got it. Yeah, it's easier than I was making it. It was just not clear how to do it. I'm pretty sure, like, in the original, you got, like, a guidebook that kind of teaches you. But, uh, in the, uh, in the remake, it's a lot more explained, which is nice. Seven! Big Brother? The brothers, the brothers are united. Younger brother. At first glance, I thought he was some bodybuilder who had stayed, who had strayed from his gym. Bodybuilder. I'll take that as a compliment. Anyway, brother, what are you doing here? Oops, that's seven. Anyway, brother, what are you doing here? We're on the way to, to Sable Mountains. To, to the Returner hideout, no doubt. I've been watching from afar, hoping the world might regain, regain some sanity. At this rate, Figaro will be reduced to a puppet state. Our time to strike back has arrived. The Empire is going to pay for what it's done. Think a bear like me could help you in your fight? You'd join us? Seven. I think Duncan would rest easier if he knew his disciple played a part in bringing peace to the world. Let's get going! Received a tent. All right. Yeah, I think seven was like the first instance of like overdrive attacks or limit breaks kind of except his are just actual moves he can do anytime but that kind of thing you know? there's another character as well but uh, seven does appear first in the in the story do 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 All right. Oops, not that. Good, we made it out. Now, I think it might teach me here. Let's, yeah, there we go. All right, down. This is way. E this will be way easier with a a keyboard. That that's how I'm playing instead of a controller. Uh, D-pad's fine, but some moves are difficult just because the D-pad 
because the arrows are connected, you know, to one one pad, and it's easier to mess up. So X, Y, down, up, down, slanted, left. Okay. I'll I'll try these for my next fight. <laughs> Let's see if that actually... Yep, or a bolt. Nice. Nah, he does a Kamehameha wave. No, I'm just gonna defend. Let's... Is that the one? Nah, that was the wrong one. Okay. Let's practice that one. There we go. Superplex. Or suplex, rather. Oh, I missed. Oh, well. Cool. Now, interestingly, Sabin's super moves actually scale with magic, not strength. So it tends to be better to level him up with magic once we get to that point. Which I didn't know until uh, months ago. You would think he's being all like strengthy moves. It would be a it would be a strength leveler, but nah, magic seems to be the thing. Definitely did not suplex everything after this point. Oops, wrong one. Do it! Suplex. Get him! Yeah! <laughs> well, I love that they just 180 the the uh, sprite. When he suplexes him, let's turn him upside down. Why can't I get in there? Is that not right? My God! Oh, there it is. <laughs> uh, okay. The Returners hideout. King Edgar, this way, please. Cool, we got a full party now. Out of the way. You know what? I'm gonna see what y'all got for sale. We got an inn. That'll be nice. Take a nap, and it's free! Free nap. Tents are always good. But I don't need another tent right now. I could go for some tonics, though. Oh. Let's have... That many.
<laughs> Received a potion. Bannon, we, we brought the girl with us. Is she the girl who can take talk to Espers? Espers? Seemed the Empire had complete control over her. Carrier Pigeons brought word that she wiped out 50 of the Empire's best soldiers in a few minutes. That's a lie! Terra! Bannon, she doesn't remember anything. Stay where you are. Perhaps you've heard this story. Once when people were pure and innocent, there was a box they were told never to open, but one man went and opened it anyway. He unleashed all the evils of the world. Envy, greed, pride, violence, control. All that was left in the box was a single ray of light, hope. We now confront those evils. And you are the last ray of light, our only hope. Bannon! I'm so tired. Let me rest a while. Someone important to me was jailed by the Empire. I've hated the em Empire ever since. I joined the Returners when I realized the Empire was rotten to the core. I wanted to make a difference. But I have no significant other in my life. That's not entirely true. Besides, I'm sure there are people who feel you're important to them. They're, they're counting on you. Yes, that was. They had to change it up a little bit because it's Final Fantasy World. Couldn't couldn't fully pull from from Greek myth if there's no Greece. Please join us in our battle. True knight. is in the party. The only thing I can add is that you can trust my brother impl implicitly. He's always been fair with me. You can trust him, Tara. But don't you dare tell him I said that. Oh. Ooh. Awesome. Thanks, Scott. A hidden passage in the wall behind the boxes in the north room. Oh, look at that. Kinda. Is that the one? No. Received an antidote. Um, not sure I follow you. Is it here? Here? Oh my, there it is. <laughs> A white cape. Cool, thank you. Nice call. Alright, it'll be this. Oops, a uh, relic. <laughs> Sweet. Protects against imp and mute. Alright. And increases defense and magic defense. Hooray! You know what? I'm going to check this sort of suit of armor. Nope. Ah, all right. A green cherry. 
Hello, Edgar. It's going to be tough to talk you into helping us. If we push you too hard, we're no different than the Empire. So, we want you to make up your own mind. Bannon? He went outside a moment ago. Have you made a decision? Will you become our last ray of hope? Okay. You will? Really? But... I'm scared. The person who possesses this relic need not fear harm. Please, Terra. I'd like you to take it with you. What is this? A lucky charm. Take it. Received gauntlet. I have a plan. Please, get everyone together. Oh no! I didn't say no, I'm sorry. <laughs> what would he have said if I said no? <laughs> yeah. I have no idea. Right. We all know that the Empire is using Magitek power in battle. The point is, how has the Empire created it? Oh, you get different items? What's he give you for a no? You know, I'm... Well, I can just reset my save. Just a moment. <laughs> Alright. I want to see what I get. Hopefully I wasn't too far behind. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. Yeah, we got seven, so we're good. Must be in the... Uh... Yeah, right on. Okay, get the thing. I'll just fast forward this conversation. Blah 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 Okay. Blah 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 blah. Go back and get that white cape again. Good. Air Lancet. True Knight. Phoenix down. Cool. It's worth a reload, all right. Good. No, I won't be your hope, unless you give me money. Let's go for relic. Also, welcome y'all to uh, Jishin Koku and Scott Ridgely. There we go. Do -de -do -de -do -de -do -de -do. Anything in there? Nope. Da 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 ba da ba ba ba. Talk to seven. Yeah 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 yeah. Okay. Oh no, this is. Uh, I haven't played it in a little while, but uh, I have. I have played it before. Uh, this is my first time playing this uh, SNES version in, since, like, middle school. But I played the GBA version uh, a few years ago as well. Alright, now I can go talk to Bannon. Did they change the... It sounds like y'all know more about the game than I do. Do y'all know if they, like, changed the difficulty of the game between the versions? Alright. Will you become our hero? No. I see. Oh. I said no. <laughs> he just sent me back in. He'll give you an item. Say no with Bannon. Go speak to the man in the north room. He'll give you an item. Then tell Bannon yes. All right. Neat. Hello, north room man. I understand your unease, but even as we speak, innocent lives are being lost. 
Please, we need your abilities. This relic will help keep you safe. Genji gloves, oh my god. We truly need your help. Yes, thank you. Please join us in our battle. Yeah, that's that was definitely worth it. Genji gloves are always... Genji equipment's always really good in, in these games. Possible to equip each hand with a weapon. Yes. <laughs> yes! Oh my gosh, that's so good. I need to look up all the good secrets. Because that was a good one. Well, I think I don't have a sword. Oh well. Well, it'll be there when I need it. Say no three times? Really? Really? Okay. What happens then? <laughs> this is fun. I said no! Quit asking me, Bannon. I thought as much. Have you made your decision? No. Oh, uh, you're sure about this? Alright, there we go. Now now it's like a cutscene. Hope. How can anyone put their hope in me? Oh, please teach me. What's going on? What happened? Oh no! Someone did it. Someone did a number on him. So South Figaro Empire took Figaro. Coming this way. Ugh. They found us. We haven't a moment to lose. Saying no three times will skip the long cutscene. Interesting. Lock! I know. Someone has to sneak into South Figaro and show the Empire, slow the Empire down, right? This is right up your alley. Good luck. Terra, please wait for me, and please, don't let a lecherous young king who shall remain nameless near you. Lock! Big Brother. Aren't you ever going to... Big brother, aren't you ever going to grow up? Oh, what are we going to do? We'll escape down the Leet River and make our way to Narsh. I want to see the es that Esper for myself. Right. There's a raft by the back entrance. It's a gamble, but we're fresh out of options. You're in danger here. Come with us to Narsh. You're pr you'll probably even gain some understanding of your own abilities. We've no time to dilly-dally. Let's make for Narsh. There was a whole big cutscene I essentially skipped by, uh... Saying no three times. <laughs> Interesting. Dilly-dally, shilly-shally. Here we go. This raft will take us to Narsh. Hop aboard the raft. What was the, what was the cutscene I missed, I wonder? Would it, be, would it have been better for the story if I'd just watched it? Head toward Narsh, but protect Bannon at all costs. Yeah, I got my Genji glove. If Bannon is put out of commission, your journey's over. Hmm. Yeah! Ah, right. Good call. I, I keep forgetting about Rose. So you do less damage if you're in the back row, but you also take less damage. <sighs> no, I'm using another platform. Hence my ability to fast forward. Let's go. Now, does this matter? I'm, I, I would love to, for the folks who know what they're doing, 
better than I do. I'm gonna use the restroom real quick, but yeah, feel free to feel free to inform me. Uh, this is fun because I've played it before. I'm not really gonna get spoilers uh, from it, so so any uh, any additional info like secret stuff, I'm totally up for. All right. You need to do the row thing in the main menu for it to stay permanent. The row thing? Okay, gotcha. I see. To have them in the back row. Yeah, I'll have to wait till we're done with this section since I can't go into my menu for while I'm on the raft. Cool. Heal, Bannon. Thank you, Healy Man. Uh, hooray. <sighs> Ooh. Yeah, we'll just have Bannon doing doing his health move. <laughs> Fast forward. It's useful. But yeah, I got the Genji glove. I didn't have another weapon on me at the time, but once we do... Nah, I don't want to waste that, because I know what's coming. Get him! Get the dragon. Or not. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, that was the wrong combo. Hmm. Ah, well. I did left down left. Oh, you can fast forward? What kind of magic is this? <laughs> like that. <laughs> that was too much. That was too fast. Well, that's neat. You essentially skip a cutscene. Uh, um, you know what I'm going to do? Sweet mother of the gods! I'm going to save here. I kind of want to rewatch that cutscene and just then bring myself back here. I want to say yes to Bannon. I care about the story. It's been a while. Give me a sec. Yes, yes, yes. Let me play. <laughs> yeah. That's what it is. Edgar. By the stars. Alright, yeah, I want to hear whatever speech and stuff I'm going to get from this. Okay. Bannon. Yes, I will be the guy. You will? Really? But I'm scared. The person who possesses this relic need not fear harm. Please, Terra, I'd like you to have this. It's the gauntlet. And then what? I have a plan. Please get everyone together. Okay, cool. Yeah, we get a whole scene. Fun. Right. We all know that the Empire is using Magitek power in battle. The point is, 
How has the Empire created it? I had Locke look into the rumor that the Empire is forging the world's finest forcing the world's finest scholars to study espers. <sighs> All the trouble in Narsh is, o is over an esper, too. You, you mean there's some connection between espers and Magitek? I can only recall one thing linking espers with Magitek power. You don't mean... Indeed, the ancient war of the Magi. No, it can't be! My grandma used to tell me stories about magical machines. Could they have been true? Could that ancient tragedy be playing out once again? It's just speculation. But historical studies have provided a number of conflicting and frightening, frightening theories. According to one theory, humans and machines were imbued with powers drained from espers. That could explain Magitek power. We can only fight Magitek enemies with Magitek weapons. It's risky, but if we have Terra, speak with that Esper. It might just wake up. I wonder if that's wise. Who can say? Regardless, we need Terra's help. Terra! I'll do it. Ah, what nonsense. You sound as if you're enjoying this. What? What's that noise? Alright, and then dead guy comes in. Alright. Gotcha. Emergency! Sir Bannon! Alright, now we get it. Cool. <laughs> I just wanted to see the scene. There we go. Now I can change the rows. Alright. Row. Neat. Row, row, row your boat. Gently down the stream. From my point of view, the Jedi are evil! Oh, let's try up. Yeah, a bit more of a lore dump. Yeah, some of the folks in here haven't played it or seen the story, so... Lordy, lordy. <laughs> yeah, that's that's awesome. Getting that Genji glove so early. Getting the dual willed. Die with the wrong way. Boo. Left again. Yeah, it's been a while for me. Not too long, but it, at least for this version, yeah, it's been a while. Living on the edge. I'm not going to save. What? What is it? <laughs> Game over. Don't tease the octopus, kids. Good old Ultros. Fire. Oh. I'm going to suplex Ultros. Seafood soup. Oh! Can't. Let me get my gym. Magic? Oops. Not that one. Maybe I can't suplex ultras. I can at least punch him a lot. Yeah, ouch! Seafood soup. 
Yeah, keep doing it to Terra. Magic, it doesn't matter if you're blinded. Magic still works. Yeah, ouch! I'm gonna try to suplex him one more time. Muscle heads, hate him! Ouch! Nope. Yeah, Yowch! Ooh, that's bad. Don't do it! Oh, not Bannon! Bannon fell, dang it! That was just random chance. No fair. Dang it, and I didn't save. That's what I get for living life on the edge. <laughs> Oops. Alright. Fine. I'm gonna fast forward. We win! God. Yeah, that one just seemed like a random chance. Maybe I should just have Bannon defending. Uh, like, defending and healing. Because that last move just massacred him. And he was in the back row and everything. Health. This time. This time I'll do it. Uh -huh. Save. Well. Okay. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, I didn't put him in the back row. Ah, well. I'll just do it for the Ultras fight. It won't matter. Yeah, yeah, it, uh, 94. That's right. Ooh! Delicious morsel. Oh, let me get my bib. I said jib last time. <laughs> okay. Punch to puss. Not healing, you're defending, Bannon. Bow, 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 
Defend. Yeah, it's so good. Uh, that's all, friends! Remember sneaking out of school when the game first released so you could go to your friend's house and watch him play it? Fair enough. Yeah, I guess we thrashed it. Don't bet on it. It's probably just hiding from us. Ew! Something stuck to my leg! Tara, get over here! It's alright now. Watch out! I'm gonna hit it with a blitz! No, Seven. Don't distract me, brother. Oh, what are you doing? Ah, uh, he's always been a tad zealous. Seven! Don't worry about him. Are you sure he's okay, Bannon? You should know better than any of us. Any moment, he'll flop right onto the raft. Oh, what the? Seems a little too perky. Huh. Seven! Seven! Take care of yourself! Seven! Hmm. <sighs> Edgar and Terra race toward Narsh while protecting Bannon. But what about Seven, who was swallowed by the who was swallowed by the raging waters, and how is Locke faring after having penetrated the Empire's defenses in South Figaro? It's all going, is it, is all going according to plan? Choose a scenario. Choose a scenario, Kupo. You know what, this isn't a bad place to leave off for today. A good triple fork in the road point. Yeah, we've been going for close to three hours uh the timing's a little off because i've reset a couple times but <laughs> yeah uh, this is yeah this is a pretty good like cliffhanger point i think we can decide where to go next time thank y'all for hanging out and like guiding me uh, showing me some secret stuff i had no idea about uh yeah michael scott and Jay Shinkoku. This has been really fun. Uh, you know, I do this every day, uh, at least Monday to Thursday, every, most weekdays, um, at the same time, 11 p.m., or sorry, 11 a.m. Uh, Pacific time, which would be 1 Central time. So, y'all are certainly welcome to come and watch and kind of if you want to, just throw out little bits of guidance here and there. This has been fun. Like replaying a game and learning learning new secrets about it uh, with the input from fans. That's a, from folks who are, who, who are watching. So, yeah, that's that's been really fun today. So thank you all. And uh, yeah, I'll pick this up tomorrow at the regular time. And would you look at that? My video didn't freeze once. Then uh, I got a new webcam and initially it was having freezing issues but I had to update my motherboard and chipset uh, yeah seems to be working well all right everybody i hope you all have a good rest of your day and i will see y'all next time all right all right bye bye <laughs>